now different forms of energy as we already knew that energy cannot be created or destroyed but it can be in different forms okay so now we will learn about the different forms of energy energy be, energy can be in this kind of forms like mechanical energy heat energy muscular energy light energy sound energy electrical energy chemical energy magnetic energy nuclear energy etc okay now what is mechanical energy mechanical energy is the energy gained by an object due to its motion or its position or its shape okay so mechanical energy is a kind of energy which is gained by an object due to its motion or speed or its position or its shape okay so mechanical energy can be of two types one is kinetic energy and another is potential energy okay so what is kinetic energy energy gained by an object due to its speed is known as kinetic energy so to have kinetic energy uh, an object should be in motion okay so an object so uh, if the object has some speed or if it is in motion then the object will gain kinetic energy so kinetic energy is the energy or is the form of energy which is gained by an object due to its speed okay like energy gained by a moving car due to its speed suppose a car is running at very high speed so because of its speed the car will gain some kinetic energy okay so this kind of energy is known as kinetic energy and the measure of kinetic energy is half mv square okay here m is the mass of the object and v is the speed of that object okay so if we know the mass of the object and the speed of the object then we can calculate the kinetic energy of that object okay and it will be half mv square okay so suppose a car of mass m and speed v running in a road then what will be the measure of its kinetic energy the measure of its kinetic energy will be half mv square okay so another form of mechanical energy is potential energy so what is potential energy energy gained by an object due to its position or change in shape is known as potential energy okay so what is energy energy is reason behind any work okay so suppose if you put a ball at a very high position okay then uh, you can see if you if you lift the ball the ball will fall through ball towards earth okay so that means when we put the ball high or when we take the ball at a higher position the ball will gain some energy to do some work okay so that kind of energy is known as potential energy because of the position of the ball or because of that height of that ball the ball will be able to do some work that means when we we have taken the ball at a very high position the ball will gain some energy because of its position and that energy is known as potential energy okay and the measure of potential energy is mgh here m is the mass of the ball g is the gravitational acceleration which is 9.8 or 10 meter per second square and h is the height of the ball okay suppose you have taken 
the ball 10 meter from ground okay and the mass of the ball is 5 gram or 5 kilogram so uh, the ball is of 5 kilogram and we have taken it 10 meter above the ground then the potential energy stored in that ball will be 5 into the height 10 into gravitational acceleration whatever you take 9.8 or 10 ok so these are the two types of mechanical energy so what is mechanical energy? mechanical energy is the energy gained by an object due to its motion, its position or its shape ok so mechanical energy is of two types one is kinetic energy another, another is potential energy energy gained by an object due to its motion is known as kinetic energy and energy gained by an object due to its position or shape is known as potential energy okay the measure of kinetic energy is half m square and the measure of potential energy is m into g into h where m is the mass of that object g is the gravitational acceleration and h is the height of that object okay i hope you understood